guys welcome back to my channel this is Naja here with budgeting the bacon and this is mortgage monday thank you guys so much for being here if you are invested in how much we are trying to pay on our mortgage each month so that we can pay it off a whole lot sooner than what the bank says that we owe definitely stay tuned bacon bit squad thank you guys so much for being here and to those new members that have subbed to my channel thank you guys so much for being here i do hope that you find some enjoyment and you enjoy the content that you are seeing and that you decide to go ahead and stick around so this week we're going to look at how much we were able to pay last week and this week now i will say the payment for this week which is the week of october 10th through like the 14th or the 15th um it will come out on october 11th because on the 10th is a holiday and no banks are open so just want to go ahead and put that out but i am going to share what was paid on october 3rd that is when we last left off and how much was taken out which was the regular normal principal payment. When we last left off, it was $27,999. Then on the third, we had our payment come out. So it consists of our property taxes, our homeowners insurance, and then also the principal payment. So the principal payment that came out was $741.64. And that left us with a balance of $27,000. $257.36. I'm going to go ahead and switch up this marker because it's not working too well. So that is where we were at the end of last week. This week, and I apologize, I didn't already fill this in, but it should not take long whatsoever. So let's go ahead and carry this balance over of $27,257.36. This week we are making a payment of $200.36. This will leave our new balance of $27,057. Almost up under the $26,000 mark. And then also I need to do a quarter three update down here. As you can see, I did one for First quarter, second quarter, need to do third quarter, just showing how much extra that we paid in principal payments. So let's go ahead and go over here. And so quickly, let me see where we're at because I didn't do this beforehand. Normally I try to be super prepared for my videos, but you know, things occur, things happen. So let's see where we're at. So 45, so that's 34, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, Okay, so we can go ahead and color in two more. And I think what I'm going to do is use a marker, a highlighter. I'll just use a highlighter because I don't have my colored pencils. I recently revamped my office, decluttered, threw out a bunch of stuff, organized as best as I could with the space that I have. I'll probably do like a little small video showing you guys how that went and what it looked like beforehand. It was a mess. Um, I showed a couple people through DMs that, you know, had an interest in it. Um, and one person said, I actually, it was like, do a video about it, which was Budget by the Bag. Crystal, shout out to her. If you are not following her channel, definitely go follow her channel um, and support her as well. She is a cash stuffing budgeter as well as she's also saving for her new home that she is looking to move into. Yes, look at this guys, we're almost done, almost done. And so not gonna color in anything here, just gonna hold off on this right here, going to hold off on this right here, and then we're gonna hold off on this right here until the end of October. So yeah, that is where we are at, $27,057 dollars for this week my goal is to get it up under twenty thousand dollars by the end of this year december 31st 2022 that is the goal i don't care if it's by just a penny i want it up under twenty thousand dollars and then we'll move forward and we will definitely be paying off this mortgage next year in 2023 which is super exciting i'm thinking about all the money that i will now have on my check 
that I don't <laughs> that does not have to go to more extra mortgage principal payments. It's, it's going to be awesome. It's going to open up open up a whole new world for us. So I'm already thinking about some videos and some content that I can do surrounding that about when the mortgage gets paid off. What does that look like for me um, and finances and where does my channel go from there because as you guys know once it's paid off the mortgage monday series is going to end i know wow wow boo boo sad sad i get it but exciting things in store moving forward so i hope that you guys stick with me on this journey um as we continue on in wealth building because that is what it is all about and to enjoy this video feel free to go ahead and give it a like if you happen to like any of the videos on my channel and you want to go ahead and continue to support my channel feel free to go ahead and subscribe hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any type of upload and until the next mortgage monday video bye guys